Uh, let's come back to one of our other big stories of the day, the sad news of the death of Sir Terry Pratchett. The Buckinghamshire born writer was best known for his Disc World series, which consisted of some 40 volumes. A huge seller, enormous seller. Um, after being diagnosed with Alzheimer's, Sir Terry campaigned for more research into the condition and became a patron of Alzheimer's Research UK in 2008. Tim Parry from the charity says that he played a vital role in raising awareness of the disease. For so long, it was it was hidden behind closed doors. It wasn't talked about. And, and Terry, uh, speaking so publicly, so um, uh, amazingly about his, his condition, has, has really, really changed things. So that contribution to everyone living with dementia, and certainly to, to Alzheimer's Research UK, us as a charity, is just enormous. Well, let me bring Jason Anthony into the conversation. Jason runs the Terry Pratchett Discworld newsletter and website. Jason, very good evening to you. Good evening. I wish we could be talking under more pleasant circumstances, of course. Um, what is it about Discworld, the series, that has been so extraordinary? What has made it so extraordinarily successful? I, it's, it's difficult to put your finger on just one thing. I think it's just Terry's amazing writing style. He he had that vision that was was unique. He, he worked differently to everyone else. He saw things in a very, very different way. He would look at something you or I would just take for granted and he'd twist it and so you, you'd get a, a, a different view on things. And when you start seeing things his way, you kind of, you start questioning things and, and you ask why, why are things the way they are? Uh, and of course, the fact that they're very, very funny. Did we underestimate the scale of his success? I think he was underestimated by, or unrecognised by, the, the the people that decide who are the good people, rather than the, the fans themselves, the readers. I mean, obviously, he sold 70, 80 million books. You, uh, uh, Jason, you can't argue with the figures. They're amazing. Absolutely. And, and he was an incredibly terrific writer. I mean, 70 books, 41 Discworld books, the new one's out on the 18th of June, um, which is going to be bittersweet because we know that's the last one. You know, it's the last chance we get to read his wisdom for the for fresh. It's 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 a horrible, horrible thing to think about. Did you ever meet him? Yeah, several times. He was a really, really genuine and lovely, lovely person. He he was a huge friend to his fans. Uh, he would go out of his way to talk to us. Um, he he was a really, really genuine, nice man. There was never any aloofness. There was never any sort of disconnect between him and the fans. I mean, he was he was part of the family. Yeah, exactly. I mean, even when he got his knighthood, um, I, I, he came into the shop when I was in Wincanton, and I said, "Oh, well, do we call you Sir Terry now?" And he goes, "No, no, I'm just Terry." You know, he he he, 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 he was immensely proud of being knighted, but he didn't. He didn't wear it as sort of like some kind of way of separating himself from anyone else. He was just the same person. So, you know, I don't think that really changed him. He was just a really genuine, genuine person. He's left behind an enormous body of work. I mean, d does it stop now, or is there a chance that someone else can pick up the map? Can anyone write like Terry Pratchett? I don't think so, um, and I hope not. The, the closest person that there's ever been linked with that is his, uh, his daughter, uh, Rihanna. And obviously, our condolences are with, with Rihanna and, and Lynn, his wife, and, and, and uh, Rob, his PA, who has worked tirelessly with him for years. But um, he, no, I don't think so. I think even Rihanna's turned around and said, the books are sacrosanct. They're not going to be any more. That is it. Um, there's going to be continuation. There's going to be new TV series. There's going to be movies. There's a whole load of stuff in the pipeline, but there's going to be no more, other than the one that's just been written, there's going to be no more books. Jason, thank you for joining us. Wish you well. Jason Anthony runs the Theory Project Discworld newsletter and website.